Well, good afternoon once again, YouTubers. Uh, today we have another beauty. Uh, this is a True Tone, and the model number is a DC5915. And uh, these show up once in a while, although they're not too often seen. Uh, it's unique in that it has a two-speed changer in it, made by Voice of Music. And uh, f for whatever reason, these changers were always placed with an EMIC amplifiers. I mean, they always had one tube amplifiers or single stage amplifiers. Um, they made two high class models. They made an Arvin and they made a Voice of Music, both in stereo. And I don't know what they used for cartridges, but again, they were single stage amps for each side. And um, the arm is so thin that um, they must have made a special uh, cartridge for stereo in there because it's not standard half inch. So you have to jury rig something in there if you wanted a, a higher end cartridge. But then of course you'd have to beef up the amplifier a little bit too. Uh, this features a 25L6 and it has a selenium rectifier. Again, it's a single stage amp. And uh, this had some issues. Uh, so it's been totally rebuilt. It had a dead 25L6, so a new one was put in there. All the caps have been changed. Uh, there's a new idler. Um, there are new motor mounts. There's a brand new cartridge in here, uh, a cartridge and needle combination. So it actually has quite a bit of, of uh, volume for a single tube amplifier. Uh, one of the few that I've seen that has some decent quality as, as far as uh, the audio is concerned. And in the front we have the tone control, we have the volume control, and taking a look up front, um, we have the 1645 um, lever here, and incidentally this is new here and the on off reject button also new so those those were replaced as well so I mean this thing is ready to roll it's in a beautiful shape now what makes these so unique is that the the way they play the arm comes up it actually will touch the record to make sure there's one there so it'll play it in the event there is none in there it comes up to feel for it and it's not there uh, it just shuts down which is kinda nice so it's an automatic shut off and that's really nice for a compact player like this and that's why these are so sought after it's not really the 16 rpm feature although there are 16 rpm records and in fact uh, this happens to be a set of records right here it's a storybook Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde those are all 16 uh, rpm so we're going to do a little demonstration here we're going to place um, a 45 on here and again now this is not for the content of the music but rather to demonstrate the player so we have on a King label my boy flat top by Boyd Bennett and we're also going to put a 16 rpm one of the audiobook ones the strange case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde here and I'm going to switch that to 16 when we finish off on the first record so watch as this plays and I'm going to reject it it's going to come up and feel for the record before it drops it.
let's swing it to 16 as you'll see it slow down to a crawl and I'll watch it come up the field for the record before it drops it down this is slow as molasses in January The Strange Case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde The Story of the Door Mr. Addison, the lawyer, was a man of a rugged countenance that was never lighted by a smile. Cold, scanty, and embarrassed in discourse, backward in sentiment, lean, long, dusty, dreary, and yet somehow lovable. At friendly meetings, and when the wine was to his taste, something eminently human beaconed from his eye. Yeah, that's enough something of that crap. Let's which reject never it. found its way into his talk, but which spoke not only in these silent... Now watch as it goes to feel for a record again and doesn't find it. And now it should shut down automatically. Just like that. And there you go. In my personal opinion, what I wish they had done was to make a 3345 player, um, you know, with, an, <laughs> with a, uh, a spindle that you could put on there to play the 45s. To me, that would have been uh, a nicer player to have. But... They chose 16 and 45, and I guess if you're blind or if you like to see and hear stories uh, or you like church music, <laughs> that's primarily what you're going to see on 16 RPM. But in any event, this is going to be for sale. I'm going to be putting this up on YouTube. Uh, I am going to include the entire storybook here of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde in uh, 16 RPM. And one last thing, this does lock into place. There's a lockdown. Give it a good push and it locks down like that. And uh, let's take one quick look at the outside of the case. It's kind of attractive. And that's that. So, another beautiful piece from the 50s. This is around 1956 or 57, I believe. It's uh, ready to go. It's going to be right for the right person. Uh, the, the changer itself is what, what is most sought after. And um, they always sell. They, they sell fast and they bring big bucks too. There you have it. Another fine piece from the 50s. I hope you enjoyed seeing something just a little different. Stay tuned. There will be more to come.